Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today I'm gonna do another video about Fitbit Versa where I'll be precisely showing you how to create a playlist, uh, edit and delete a playlist from your Fitbit Versa. If you guys don't know already, Fitbit Versa can store up to 2.5 gigs of music files or songs onto it which you can play onto your wireless Bluetooth headset. Uh, I have done a detailed video about how to transfer music onto your Fitbit Versa. Please check it at the end of this video and in the description down below. And if you guys are wondering about this dual monitor setup for the single laptop, I recently did a video about this. Please make sure you check it out in the description down below. So if you guys are someone who are new to our channel, please make sure you subscribe to our channel. We do a lot of videos about Fitbit Versa cooking and reviews for various tech. Uh, by subscribing to our channel, you are helping our channel to grow and so that we can post uh, regular content uh, consistently and if you guys are here because of Fitbit Versa make sure you check out our playlist of Fitbit Versa where we have 33 plus videos and more to come all about Fitbit Versa and I'm pretty sure you'll learn a lot so let's get started um, now there are two tips I want you guys to know before we actually attempt to transfer uh, music on to the Fitbit Versa uh, number one is you want to make sure that your Fitbit Versa is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your laptop is or computer is. Uh, it is really important because sometimes if you go into the, into the Fitbit app of your phone, you will see that the watch is connected, but that doesn't mean that it is connected to the Wi-Fi itself. It's sometimes it's just connected to the Bluetooth uh, towards the phone. So you can go into the Fitbit app. In the settings, you will find Wi-Fi uh, connection or network connection, and then you can connect your watch to Wi-Fi. Um, once that's done, uh, the tip number two over here is uh, which you may not find anywhere it's my personal tip you want to do the whole process near the Wi-Fi router because sometimes if the watch is far away from the Wi-Fi router it may drop the connection or just the network might get lost and uh, the process gets interrupted so you want to stay close to the Wi-Fi router so that uh, the, the connection is pretty strong once you have done that uh, you want to make sure that you um, uh, like I'm using a Windows computer I don't know about uh, Mac OS but it should be pretty uh, standard and same you wanna download the Fitbit app as you can see right here from the Microsoft app, app store once you open the Fitbit app uh, you will uh, uh, when you go in the dashboard on the top right you will see your tracker once you double click that uh, you'll be taken to this now you will have all these options over here you want to go into the media once you go into the media it's gonna look up for your watch uh, once it finds your watch it'll give you these options you want to go into the personal music options once you go into the personal music options um, I'm gonna jump on to the watch um, you see the music right here when you want to transfer the music actually you you will find transfer music all the way at the bottom once you click that uh, your watch will be connected to the Fitbit app on your Windows computer and then you can just transfer the music it says here use your computer to uh, start transferring the music and then you can actually end the transfer from your watch as well which I'm not gonna do uh, because I want you to guys uh, see um, now uh, the, the first thing is you will notice right here create a new playlist so once you click that you can actually name uh, the playlist uh, let's name the playlist to uh, new in this case uh, once you have done that uh, you can actually change the name right here once you click this you can change the name and if you let's say you want to delete the whole playlist you just click here and uh, playlist gets removed now to transfer the song all you gotta do is drag and drop the music file here or browse I'm not gonna click browse I'm just gonna drag a music file uh, from my computer and I'm just gonna drag it right here so there you go now uh, 
it just shows that the music file is here but it doesn't mean that it is on the watch to get it on the watch you have to get this uh, purple icon or purple tick mark right here you can see all the songs are actually on my watch because there is like a purple tick mark right there uh, so to get it on the watch all I have to do is either click here or click here so once I click here you can see the transferring process starts and you can actually um, see that uh, it says transferring over here uh, the purple circle once the transferring is done it's gonna be a purple dot over here and a purple tick mark over here uh, so that means that the song has been transferred onto your watch and then it's ready to be played on your watch it sometimes takes a while uh, I'm gonna let it transfer and be right back okay so the transfer process has done you can see that there is a purple dot right here um, depending on the size of the song or the music file it may take a while uh, and also depends on the upload speed of your network connection as well but pretty much once it's it's transferred it's you will see this uh, purple tick mark that means it is available onto your watch now uh, you can see the music files onto your watch uh, but you have to end now uh, which I'll do it just so you guys can see um, I hit end and now you can see this new playlist over here with one track of three minute uh, you can see it right onto the computer as well now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit transfer music again uh, so the connection gets established and then I can actually uh, delete the uh, playlist which I created uh, sorry it's a bit out of focus uh, which I created um, okay so now that the connection has established I'll try to delete the playlist which we created and you can do that by hitting this uh, uh, delete icon which is remove manually created playlist once you click that you get this option to delete the playlist Are you sure you want to delete the playlist the action cannot be undone once you hit yes delete uh, Then it's gonna delete uh, It says not found on this computer because uh, It has been deleted from the watch Okay, so now you can see that the playlist has gone um, it is not over here uh, it's got deleted now I'm gonna hit end now uh, as you can see that the new playlist is not there which we created and delete so guys that's how uh, you create edit and delete a playlist on your Fitbit Versa I really hope you guys like this video uh, please make sure you subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up and share it as much as you can so that it can help other uh, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next video so then, okay.